a heart attack happens. When the blood flow that brings oxygen to a part of your heart is severely reduced or cut off completely, this is what the inside of a normal, healthy blood vessel looks like. Notice how there are no fatty deposits on the artery wall, and blood is able to flow through smoothly. Atherosclerosis is a process where the coronary arteries that supply the heart with blood can slowly become narrowed by accumulation of LDLC, also known as bad cholesterol, and other substances. This complex lesion with a lipid-rich core is called a plaque. Certain risk factors, such as diabetes, high levels of bad cholesterol, smoking, and hypertension, can damage the artery's inner lining. In this artery, bad cholesterol and other substances have started to deposit on the artery wall. Over time, more and more of these substances build up, forming a plaque in the artery wall. This causes the blood vessel to narrow and makes them less flexible. This leads to abnormal blood flow. Eventually, blood flow can be severely reduced by the continually growing plaque. The plaque can rupture, leading to exposure of the lipid-rich core of the previously stable lesion to blood and formation of blood clots or thrombus. The blood clot blocks the blood flow through the artery to the heart muscle, which is the cause of the heart attack. If blood flow is not restored quickly, the section of heart muscle affected begins to die. The amount of damage to your heart depends on the size of the area supplied by the blocked artery and the time between your heart attack and treatment.